Hello, boys and girls out there in YouTube land. This is you too young for this. And welcome again to another adventure in Let's Play Uncharted Drake's Fortune, part 23. Last time we uh, eavesdropped on Roman and Navarro. Uh, Roman Navarro and that English dude, whatever his name is. Uh, let's see. And, yeah, they're threatening to kill Sully after they find the treasure. But anyway, up here before we open the gate, turn left and we find treasure number 46, Golden Ruby Inca Mask. Technically 47 if you picked up the treasure in the church, like I stupidly forgot. Yeah! Oh, you love sauce. Anyway... Open it up, and uh, we actually find outside. What's going on out here? Chapter 15 on the Trail of the Treasure. Indeed, we are. Very close to the treasure. I uh, I think we're very close, indeed. Um. Alright, so... Come out here. And it is... There's another treasure right here, hidden in the grass. Number 47, gold Inca figurine. Hmm. Apparently Incas were nudists. So, where we need to go is up there, I believe. I want to see what's over here first, because... Eh, it's a gate. Dead end. Very beautiful indeed. But, uh... Not exactly where we're going. But anyway, it's just interesting that we found this secret passage that leads us to a church and to another secret passage that leads us outside into the courtyard where uh, we were very close to where we were. Yeah, we're. it just feels like we're walking in circles. Interesting enough, trying to remember how to do this one. This is another jump puzzle. Finally, uh, after how long? Um, this one's actually fairly difficult, if I can remember, because you have to be, like, spot on with your jumping. And it's always, not this jump, but this upcoming jump with this vine right here that I always miss. But for some odd reason, I make it. Don't ask why. I just do. Apparently, I'm uh, doing fairly good right now. But anyway, what's up here? Um, Nate, into the building. Uh, into the building, please. All right. Can we drop? Yeah, we can drop. Oh, hello. Ah, they're blowing themselves up. Oh, that is good. I love the mods. I love when you guys blow yourselves up. It makes it easier work for me. Oh, my goodness. Alright. No. Oh, oh, don't. No. None of that. None of that. Alright. Wow. That was bad timing on my part. Why do you keep on throwing that friggin' grenade at me? You stupid idiots. You monster. Hey, he killed over dead. That is awesome. Two down, one more to go. Show your face. I know you're there. Alright, that it? Cool. I think... Hey, Nate, you read me? Yes, yeah. I do, Sully. Sully, I'm just going in circles here. Well, the girl and I have been reading some of the books down here, and it 
Looks like there's some kind of secret gallery at the top of the church. Can you get there? I think so. Yeah. All right. Give us a call if you find anything. Hmm. I think where I feel like there's some treasure around in here. No, no treasure. I know I'm getting close to some. And seriously, at this point in the game, it looks like you're it is you are going in circles and you're just sitting there like, what the crap am I supposed to do? Well, that's why the, my uh, grenade didn't work, because, uh, yeah. Alright, I think it's in here. Somewhere. Treasure. No, it's not in here. Okay. Dang it, I might not even be able to. Alright, so there's... There we go, we got to climb more walls. Let's see more monkey mate. Ah, okay, okay. We're heading to the second level of the church. Okay, I know, I know where we are now. I know where we are now. I, hey, come back here! Die, you crazy grenade or shotgun guy! Um, come on, show your head. That's right. That is right. You must die. Uh, in here, here it is. This golden Spanish goblet. What? Oh, balls. I missed another treasure out there. Can I get, go back outside? Please tell me I can go back outside. No, I can't. Dang it. Balls. 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 Balls! That is not good. Trust me, guys. That is seriously not good, because I doubt... Hmm. We might be able to get it. Well, we might be able to get it. We shall see. And yeah, if you look at the book, it'll... Aha! Uh -huh. uh -huh. It looks like a crest that we have seen so many times before. Yeah, I don't like this uh, jumping section at all. Hopefully, please let me do this in one go. I don't want to redo this jumping section at all. Because camera doesn't want to cooperate with me, apparently, for some odd reason. And why? They have an exploding barrel up here. I have no idea. But anyway, if you uh, look down, of course you can recognize that's where we were before fighting a whole bunch of people. We'll mar make our way back down there. Again, somehow. Don't know how, but we will. A lot of uh, crisscrossing paths in this one. And let's go this way first. Because if we come over this way, we uh, gain access to something that we can pull down. What does that do? I have no idea. Then we have to backtrack. Why do we have to backtrack? Seriously. Lots and lots of backtracking in this game. Well, 
Not really. It's mostly linear, and the storyline is linear in, in its own right. I kind of like it. But it also has that confusing aspect to it that it's just like, uh, we've been in this area before. Why are we here? And also uh, get to visit new places of the areas. All right. Jump over. Don't want to fall down. Am I? Am I seriously going to do this in one go? That is completely awesome if I am. Ah. We open up another secret passage. This whole entire place is littered with secret passages, apparently. That nobody can find except for, apparently, Nate. Isn't that how uh, adventure games go? Oh, hey. Huh. Shiny thing. Number 49, Jeweled Golden Cross. Again. Except uh, it was a silver cross. Ah. All the stained glass windows look the same except for this well, one. Hello there. Hello. You gotta be kidding. Hey, Sully. I'm here. Remember Roman and Navarro? That red herring you sent them on to get them out of the way? Yeah? Well, they're sitting right on top of the treasure vault. Oh, of all the goddamn luck. Look, I'm gonna need a diversion to get them out of there. You got it, kid. One diversion. Coming right up. And Sully. Yeah? Once they're gone, meet me in the mausoleum. But come through the catacombs. It's safer that way. Gotcha. Now I've just gotta get past all these goons without getting noticed. Yeah, like you're... Like you're good at not getting noticed. Uh, Nate, we need to drop, please. Thank you. Or just... Eh, that'll work. I got it. Sullivan has escaped. Spread out. Find him. Good work, Sully. All right, hang on, hang on. I think there's a treasure around here. All right, so apparently we have to... Ooh, sniper. I like sniping. Snipe all these enemies here. They uh, don't know I'm here yet, apparently. <laughs> That's right, headshot. Oh, hello. And a grenade launcher guy. Goodbye to you. Uh, quit moving. I see him. All right. Whoa! Hello! 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 Wow! 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 Okay. I have to be a lot quicker than what I was going at before. Hey! Oh! Hello! You see me already! That is not good. That is seriously not good if you can see me already. What? I shot at you. Um. Hello. Whoa. What? No. 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 Hello! Just 
sniping the friggin' snipers. And where's that grenade launcher guy? Like, that's enough cover, Nate. Oh, whoa, whoa. Come on, where are you? Where are you? Whoa! That's why I tried to take out the snipers and the grenade launcher guy first, but no. 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 Uh, well, it's time again, guys. Next time we shall uh, figure out how Nate gets out of this thing. Man, I keep on leaving you at the edge of gunfights. I don't know why. Anyway, this is you too young for this uh, signing off saying I have a frosty one, guys.